You mean Mona? Yeah, she definitely count. Mona. Yes, she certainly seems very confident. And she can use her astrology to guide people. Would Bennett count? Well, his luck's so bad that as long as you go in the opposite direction from him, you'll always be going the right way, right? Hmm, I see. I, I suppose I can't argue with that logic. Add him to the list! Finding everyone won't take long, so one extra person won't hurt. <sighs> I know. Would Outrider Amber be a valid candidate for this category as well? Yeah, she would! She's got a great sense of direction after all. As a matter of fact, when the Traveler and Paimon first came to Mondstadt, she was actually the one who gave us direction. Yes, she's certainly a good guide. Is there anyone else? <sighs> Let me think. <sighs> yes, I believe there may be one more. Albedo once made a set of equipment for Mika from the Reconnaissance Company. He's their surveyor and an exceptional pathfinder. He's even instructed others in the discipline of surveying before. So, in my view, he's highly unlikely to lose his way and would be very good at helping others find theirs. Cool! Another one for our list! Wait. Kali should have been here by now. Wonder what's taking her so long. M sorry. Could we continue our chat somewhere else? Oh, you wanna go see how she's doing, right? Sure. Let's all go. Hope we're not intruding or anything. Is everything okay? Ah, Sucrose! I, uh... I was preparing some stuff. Is it time already? Oh no, I... I'm sorry. Don't worry. The Traveler and I only just met up. We were just worried that you might get lost along the way. So we thought that we'd come get you. Thank you. I'm ready to join you now. Um, how's that thing going? So let's pick up where we left off. Next up is the third line. One who would never lie. Hmm. Anyone spring to mind? Uh, you really think so? Seems like it would be pretty difficult for someone in his position to avoid having to lie. Then what about Kaya? He's the cavalry captain and a rather popular figure, but... You think there's something fishy about him too, huh? Yeah, he's definitely a sneaky one. Bet he lies all the time! Hmm... I can't help but agree with you there. There's the tone deaf bard! Ugh. But on second thought, he wouldn't qualify either. He talks way too much nonsense. Hmm. Is there anyone else for missing? 